Hello guys, Keep Right On TV here, back for yet another video. Before we get into this video, let's see if we can hit 100 likes, and if you haven't already, make sure to drop a sub. Now, in today's video is going to be the preview between Birmingham City and Reading this Friday night, live on Sky Sports. Let's get straight into it. As always, we're going to be starting off with the opposition team, so yeah, let's get straight into it. Reading, of course, sitting in 8th place on 32 points. Um... Their top goal scorer is Tom Ince, the uh, son of Paul Ince, the Reading manager. Um, he's got four goals. They've also got players like Luca, Lucas um, Ual. Ua, um, and they've also got Andy Carroll. I, I don't know how old Andy Carroll is. He must be late 30s, possibly near near the age of 40 now. Um, he's got two goals for them. He has actually you know, bagged a few goals for Reading. He's turned up for them a couple of times. So... In the air as well, if he was to start, I think he could cause us a bit of problems, to be fair. Um, and of course, um, a lot of people before the season started were saying that Reading are going to be relegated. I was like, no, no, Tom Ince, um, no, Paul Ince, sorry, Tom Ince is the player. Paul Ince come into Reading, done a brilliant job, kept him up. And I think, you know, they've pushed on, they've pushed on from um, staying up last season. And um, yeah, I said they was going to finish mid-table um, at the start of the season before before balls even kicked and um yeah they're doing really well of course the last um four games we've played against reading they've won 2-1 on two occasions and win and we've won 2-1 on two occasions a 2-1 win for either side maybe on friday night getting on to blues of course we had that 0-0 draw against blackpool didn't take our chances could have easily won that game and pushed higher at the table but if we actually beat reading friday night we will go we will jump seven places, 14th to 7th. With a win, we will go above Reading as well because of the goal difference. Now, um, the thing is, um, I think this is already becoming a must win if we want to, if we have aspirations of getting into the playoffs. Because if we draw or even lose this game, then that means that we're going to be probably about six or seven, maybe seven, yeah, seven points behind the top six after the, after the top six have all played their games after... Um, we play Reading. So getting onto the lineup, of course, uh, it's going to be Ruddy. It's probably going to be Ma uh, Mark Roberts, Sanderson, and Trusty at the back again. Um, Longello, Colin, left and right wing backs. Bielik in the middle. Um, now it's going to be interesting to see um, what John Eustace actually does here because Hannibal, I nearly forgot, Hannibal is suspended for this game due to the fact that he's picked up too many yellow cards. So I would put in Bielik, um, oh, Bielik, Bakuna. And George Hall, and then the two up top now. Um, John Eustace come out and said um, after the game against Blackpool that Scott Hogan will be assessed. He picked up an injury in training before the Blackpool game, um, so hopefully he's available. But um, if Scott Hogan's not available, it's going to be Deeney and Chong. Even though I don't know, I don't know. So we play Jukovic and, and Deeney. No, I don't really think Jukovic. I, I, I think he's past it really. I know he scored. In our um, in our last home match against Sunderland, but I would bring on Jukovic as um, a bench, you know, off the bench, um, really. So yeah, um, we haven't um, won in our last two games. Um, we're going to be looking to pick up three points in this game against a really difficult. You know, they're going to be difficult to beat Red Dinar. Having a really good season, they've won their last game. Well, they've won their last two games actually. They beat Coventry at the weekend one 0 now, as I said, um, the last four games have finished 2-1. Either team have won 2-1. I'm going with Blues 2, Red in 1. I think that trend will continue. I think we'll get three points on the board and we'll climb up seven places in the table. That just goes to show how tight this league is this season. It's completely, it's complete madness how apart from you know, apart from Burnley running, running away with the league, they're basically promoted, aren't they? They're eight points clear of third place, Black uh, Blackburn. So yeah. Let me know in the comments down below what are you going for? What's your lineup? Um, let me know what your you know the lineup you would um, pick for this game, your predictions, so on and so forth. Anyway, it's been Keep Watch on TV here. Make sure to like, share, and also subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching, guys. This is it. as I said, let's see if we can get 100 likes. And uh, yeah, keep right on.